My name is Tyson Ray for those that are new. And if you're back, hey, so hey, ho, hey, ho. So guys, I hope you guys are doing well. Y'all have to excuse the light because I'm sitting here at my job here. And y'all know we had to fall back. So listen, I can't help that it's kind of dark. But listen, my jazzy life, I just want to tell you one thing. Don't ever let a woman punk your ass out, ma'am. Don't do that because I've been watching and seeing a whole lot of things. Stop letting people know that you're bothered. Interruptions from nobody because this is not about bringing y'all back here for that to happen all over again. I, I don't have the energy for that. I'm too first class for that. Um, somebody says something about you like just ignore it i feel like every time that you come and try to clap back it just makes it worse for you so i was watching a video on the live that she did and um i'm like girl like stop addressing the negativity i've always said that i love jazz's content when she does her content and just that i feel like you know at this point your channel is ruined because every time now people are just going to tune in to see what you have to say and you're just giving the people what they want you're giving them ammunition and at the end of the day it's not cute and live now you know that live probably has something on you and it's like you don't clap back to her but you clap back to your mama you clap back to strong mommy Chrissy to the reactors everybody else but live but why at this point I feel like just air your shit out and just be done with it because this is just crazy to me. Um, y'all comment down below and let me know y'all thoughts about all this craziness. And another point I want to bring up is, Jazzy, you was on live that particular day all day. Then you had the nerve to sit there in your own words to say that you and Chris were sitting there calling live. Like, for what? I'm nodding like I understand, but I'm not so sure I did. What are you calling her for? Like, that makes no sense. Don't ever let a woman know that you are bothered. Be unbothered. Because people going to do and take everything you say and just spin it to their own narrative as we have seen. Comment down below and let me know y'all thoughts because this is just crazy. Like I was watching all of it and I'm like, wow. But at the end of the day, I just feel like friends, y'all be careful of who you tell your most intimate secrets to. Not everybody is for you because a lot of people want to know your business, but they don't really tell you their business. You got to watch people like that. Guys, if you're being vulnerable with a friend and you're telling all your intimate things to them and they're not telling you anything about them watch out for them type of people because they just there just to get all your secrets get all the tea that you have so at a point in time they just gonna just do what they do as we have seen here it's crazy to me like it makes no sense y'all like what <laughs> like ain't no way i'm gonna be sitting here calling a woman and you know trying to get her side of things and for us to she already showed you about what type of woman she is you know so i just don't understand why you keep trying to be a pawn and the play that she's trying to run on you and she knows that she knows that because when i watch your live and Liv came into the chat and said i heard that you was talking about me your whole demeanor changed your whole demeanor was like damn i was like damn this bitch got this much power over you Cause this is just crazy to me y'all it really is i just don't understand how and why that this is continuing to go on this has been going on it has been brewing for a while now i just feel like at this point y'all just need to fight <laughs> y'all meet up there at hgb okay and just go ahead and throw hands and get it over with <laughs> Cause baby but jazz i got my money on you <laughs> and the reason why i say that because Liv, she got punked out in front of santa claus like i'll be damn like uh -uh. because Liv is the type to me that has a lot of mouth but don't have no follow-through behind that mouth and you know them women 
Just let him talk. Just let him talk. Just let him talk, you know? But I just feel like if she does have anything on you, Jazz, just go ahead and just say it so you can just live your life. Because it seems like you're living in her shadow because you don't want her to tell what she knows you know we all have shit you know what i'm saying so you know at this point in time just tell your own shit do it in the video you don't even have to do it in the live just be like baby you know me and chris we be getting in the scuffle but you know that's my business and i'm not gonna speak on it no more but at the end of the day nobody should be putting their hands on anybody like that's just number one you know you have beautiful children you need to ensure that your children are seeing two adults in a home that are loving towards each other who care about each other and i feel like chris sitting there on the phone with you calling live he ain't there for you he ain't for you because at the end of the day he should be like baby don't 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 you know, don't worry about that shit. I got you, you know, but we're not seeing that. So, you know, y'all comment down below. Let me know. I'm sure there'll be some more shenanigans. But, uh, you know, that's all I really got right now. I really haven't been watching like a whole lot. Well, I watch that shenanigans. But, you know, I've been watching other content and you know that's just it but i'm good y'all but i just wanted to get on and say hello say what i want to say about my jazzy's life and live and you know live like stop doing that i think live you have more things to worry about at this point in time in regards to your children and i ain't even trying to be funny but baby that would be my only reason for living and doing the things i do in order to be able to have my children back i don't know what you're doing over there but the advice that i could give to you is just leave jazz alone continue doing what you want to do and that's it and that just goes for everybody so guys on that note as always be blessed and never stress and i will talk to you later bye